I've traveled just a few miles south to the village of Billimpenta. Here, they are preparing to serve 30,000 portions of risotto. Now, the people of Billimpenta, they really believe and claim that their festival is the oldest of them all. But my risotto, the one I'm going to cook, is going to be different. It's going to be a risotto with a twist, and it's going to be a sweet one. Que bella cosa. The festival started 73 years ago as a reward to rice workers after harvest. Each June, they hold a four-day celebration. Rice master Claudio is in charge of preparing the bats of risotto. Claudio, oh, come va? Molto Tutto bene? Ma sì. Cioè, che vero? Lo, lo metti prima a bollire. E perché? E perché sono si cuoce. Ah, this is so interesting. We would normally get the raw rice, put it in a pan, and then slowly, slowly add the liquid. They do the opposite. They put the rice in the boiling water, because then all the grains of rice are completely separate. Quando i due prodotti sono cotti, pronti, vengono uniti. This is bizarre. So they do it so separately from the rice, and once both of them are completely cooked, they mix them together. I've never seen risotto made this way. I don't know what to say. And then we'll be the soup. So that's the meat going in. This festival is the highlight of the social calendar here. And preparing the risotto is a source of great pride. Beh, per me è una, veramente una soddisfazione, però per Billy Impenta è un'arte. He said it's probably the most important thing in his life because if you can do this, you're pretty much no one around this area. With just the finest pork cuts, salt, butter, garlic, and parmesan, this may not look like any risotto I know, but I can't wait to taste it. Good flavor. They got an excellent rice. The sausage, the meat is fantastic. It's got the Parmesan cheese flavor in there. Great simple food. But now it's time for me to cook for the rice masters. I'm pretty sure they won't have tasted anything like my sweet chocolate risotto. When it's done well, you cannot beat a nice rice pudding, especially for breakfast. And I'm going to show you my version, which has got chocolate, it's got raspberry, it's got honey. It's absolutely delicious. So where do we start? Here. You need a pan, okay? In there, we're going to put full fat milk. Then I'm going to use uh, caster sugar and good quality cocoa powder. And then now is the time to switch on the heat. Once you've done that, keep stirring. It will take probably about five minutes to make sure that the sugar completely dissolves. Okay, now what you have to do, my beautiful Bialone Nano rice. Now, if you don't want to use a Bialone Nano, absolutely fine. Just make sure that it's a round grain rice and it's one of those rice that absorbs the milk so it's gonna be all nice and creamy. So this one, just in, like that. And keep stirring. Okay, so this is happening. If you come closer, you can see that there are bubbles on the side of the pan. Now, this is the moment where you lower the heat and just let it simmer for half an hour. Add some honey for sweetness and vanilla for extra flavor. Now, how are we gonna make this nice and shiny? Salty butter, very important salty butter, because the little bit of salt in the butter now is gonna give different layers of flavor. So this one goes straight in there. And then I'm gonna use a good handful of raspberries and keep stirring. Okay, this is done. Put it into the cups. That is great for breakfast brunch, dinner, it's great for everything. Now, the secret is very simple. It's all about resting the rice pudding for a couple of minutes before you eat it, because what's happening on top is gonna create the little crust that when you go in there, it's gonna be all gooey, and the bottom is gonna be all nice and melty and chocolatey. Add some raspberries and then flaked almonds on top. Oh, come on, this is pretty. This is how I make my chocolate 
rice pudding. Siete pronti? Sì. Yes. Eh no, è eh, eh, Claudio first. Prima Claudio, dai. Com'è? Buono, però è buono. Tu serio? Molto buono. Claudio ha just said he was very sure about a sweet risotto, ma è the best thing that he's ever tried. Yes. Buono, eh? The next year, my sweet risotto is gonna be on the menu. L'anno prossimo si mette sul menu, eh? Ok. Promesso. We got a deal. Very good.